Well, we met about two months ago at my friend Marsha's 31st birthday dinner, and I immediately noticed Josh. <laughs> yeah, I, I can be a little shy sometimes, um, <laughs> but I said to myself, you better go up and introduce yourself, because if you don't, you're gonna regret it for the rest of your life. Um, and we started talking, and uh, well, here we are. Now we're fucking. <laughs> My parents were thrilled when I told them I was finally fucking Josh. He had been eating my pussy for so long, I began to wonder if he was ever gonna actually take out his dick and <laughs> stuff my hole. Deborah's not my typical fuck, um, and my friends were a little bit skeptical, uh, but they're coming around. They're starting to see that, um, you know, this is the woman that I wanna empty my balls in for the rest of my life. I actually still remember exactly where we were when we first fucked. It was right over there. Josh was behind me and my face was pressed up against the glass the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was giving her this tremendous pounding, you know, just really deep in there and that's when I realized at that moment that fuck like this comes around only once, so I better not blow it. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember what you said to me that night? Of course. <laughs> Fill me with your cock. Fuck my mouth, daddy. God damn it. Go deeper. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Keep fucking your little pump station. Come, Come on, on my, my back. back. <laughs> <laughs> I just spent so much time looking for a woman that I could plow so hard that she'd walk funny for two days straight, and I'm just really glad that I never gave up. No one should. I mean, the fucking you're waiting for is out there. It was for me. <laughs>